I was in shock for a long time. After 27 years, the shock from Susan Connie's loss has faded, but a mother's love is hard to forget. I mean, how can you, you know, your mother? In October 1990, 62-year-old Jane Daniel was at her home in Rogers when 27-year-old Don Davis robbed her, then shot her in the head execution style. When I came back and you know, her brains were on the wall, on the ceiling and the walls. Davis was sentenced to death two years later. I don't want him to be able to speak my mother's name ever again. He's the last person that saw her, you know, at her most vulnerable time. But throughout the years, litigation stayed his execution, forcing Connie to hear the name Don Davis over and over again. I've been promised this a couple of times. And um, I just hope this time it goes through. One of the only things standing in the way, a lawsuit against one of the lethal injection drugs. He can suffer, I don't care, because we've suffered long enough. And my mom really suffered. Even so, Connie says April 17th won't be a day of celebration. I'll be very sad, I know that. Because the day that they found him guilty, um, you know, I cried because this, this was senseless, you know, two deaths. Davis may have some last words, but Connie doesn't. I've thought of that and I really have nothing to say to him. In the end, as a mother herself, Connie showed her son how his grandmother would have acted, what she would have wanted, forgiveness. I forgave him immediately. Oh yeah, but that, it has nothing to do with him. I'm doing this for my mom.